action. Gardner going deep. Has Jeremy Gavin. Touchdown, Michigan! An incredible performance from the Wolverines, specifically these two guys. Devin Gardner, 503 passing yards, 584 total yards. Jeremy Gallon got the most of those yards, 369 receiving yards, an all-time Big Ten record. And the total offense, thanks to those two guys in particular, 751 yards. So let's bring in these two record breakers now. Jeremy and Devin, you two both answer this for me. In your opinions, which of you two had the better game Saturday? Oh, Jeremy definitely had a better game, you know. This guy. I mean, I just threw it to the open guy. I mean, I can't really, you know, I just, my job was pretty easy. I was just playing my part in the game, and whenever he <laughs> threw the ball, I caught it. And well done. He touched the ball every play, so I would say yeah. What do you game. think was working so well on Saturday for you two? I mean, I feel like we just played uh, as a complete offense. You know, the line was blocking well. The running backs ran hard. And, you know, Gallon did his job in getting open. And Funch just had 84 yards receiving as well. So I feel like everybody did their job. You know, when called upon, Jeremy Jackson came in and made a few big catches for us on third down. So I'm, I'm really happy about the uh, performance of the entire offense. At what point did both of you guys realize something special was happening in that game? After we won? Yeah. <laughs> So you tell me the entire game you didn't realize, wow, I've got 300 receiving yards right now. I mean, I wasn't really worried about the, the yards or the stats. I Man, I just wanted to win. I wanted to win for, for this guy, and I wanted to win for the rest of the team. So the stats I, I could care less about at that particular time. I didn't know how many yards I had, but I, um, Josh Furman came up to me. So he said, get down to 300 yards. I guess he had 220 or something like that. So I knew he was getting close to you know a, a record-breaking day. <laughs> Well, it worked out quite well for you, and you guys have looked good. Devin, specifically the last three games, you've been cutting down on your interceptions a lot. How come? I mean, I've just been very conscious of um, protecting the ball, and I just realized how, how much I was hurting my team, you know, and I try to just do what I can, but don't do too much. All right, let's talk about you two as friends. Jeremy, you once said you two were closer than Phineas and Ferb, so give me the best story about your friendship. <laughs> well, um... I don't know any guy that can, you know, just come over. You could talk to about anything, man. I had him come help me with all my furniture, and I feel like he was just going <laughs> to help me with, like, a TV or something and then call it a day, but he helped me with everything that I put into my apartment. And, I mean, you can't ask for a better friend than that. And, you know, I thank this guy for Yeah, man, it was just me and him, you know, and his girlfriend, so she didn't do much, you know, so. <laughs> it was a pretty – it was a long day. For, we were sweating. <laughs> it was in the summertime, too, so. It was pretty hot, you know, moved a lot of stuff, but Just we got it done, done, man. We got the job done. That's all that matters. That's all that matters, guys. Get the job done. Devin, when was the last time you heard Jeremy singing? Before when he was coming over here. He <laughs> sings all the time. I don't know what his deal is with the singing. He, think he's, he thinks he can sing. I think you should have him sing on the show right now. I mean, I don't know. Great. I don't mind. Like, I got I time. <laughs> What's his best song? I'm not even going to. Do that love one day. <laughs> nah, man. We're not gonna put Come on, Jeremy. Like I'm gonna just keep it in. I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep it in. All right. What's his worst song, Devin? I mean, I don't know. It's like this is like in one song he could be really good and then just really bad. So I mean, it depends. I, I just don't know. <laughs> he sings everything though, so it's like I don't know. Where'd that start, Jeremy? Man, when I was small, I mean. <laughs> I had to be heard from somebody. I'm too short to, to be seen, so I got to be heard from somebody. So I just started singing, man, and, you know, <laughs> just kept it, just kept it as time went along. How do you guys celebrate? Gallon just laughs at the other team. And I told him he has to stop doing that. That's, that's so me. I think that's way worse than doing a celebration. He just laughs at him and, like, I mean, I just like to thank God and, you know, give up, make my way back to the sideline. But he laughs at the other team, and, you know, it's weird for, for me. I, I wouldn't want to be laughed at. What do you laugh about there, Jeremy? I mean, because everybody pick at my size, man. And, you know, like at the end of the day, I mean, it's not about the size. You know, it's all about, you know, your will and your heart, you know. And um, just when they think that, you know, they can, like, 
take advantage of you just because you're small, man. It, it makes me laugh because I'm the one that's taking advantage of them. And it, I just find that funny. So to be clear, when the two of you celebrate something good happening, one of you thanks God and the other one laughs at the opponents. I'm laughing. <laughs> all, all throughout the game, I'm laughing, man. <laughs> it's not as bad as you making it seem. Man. What did you think about him taking number 98? I thought it was great. I mean, um, just him honoring a person like Tom Harmon, man, it's, 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 it's incredible. Like, it's, it's so much tradition behind it. And it, like, just to have that number and just to, to honor someone like that, it, it's, it's an amazing feeling for me, personally. Dev, Devin, if you could pick a number for Jeremy to wear, what would it be? Uh, I, I mean, I wanted to wear number one. You know, that was my, that was my pick for the year. Yeah. You know, but 21 is such a great number, and being able to honor Desmond Howard, who's a good friend of ours, you know, uh, he's doing a really good job of it, obviously. What are you guys looking forward to the rest of this season? What, what excites you most about the rest of this year? I mean, just getting a chance to continue to play good football, you know, and getting a chance to win more games and continue fighting for our goal of winning the Big Ten Championship. Jeremy, last chance to sing before we go. <laughs> 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 Clothes. <laughs> nah, man. <laughs> Hell is for the way you look at me. O is for the only one I see. V is very, very extraordinary. E, I don't know the rest of this song. Is even more than anyone <laughs> that you. All oh, right, we leave. <laughs> well done, fellas. Well done. Devin Gardner, Jeremy Gallon. Thanks, boys. We should have did that. Hey, no problem. Go blue. <laughs>